Hello all. I typically stink at realism for stuff like animal or human heads and the like, but I did this skull after watching a video by Thack Ironworks. The elongated skull of my attempt makes it look more like a great ape skull than a human skull, but still I was pleased. I picked up these bolts really cheap from a store near where I buy my steel, and I figured rather than using round or square stock, I'll try to make a human skull out of one of these bolts. So I want to give Thack a shout out for his wonderful video. From what I've seen, he's mainly a metal sculptor, and he's got the skills to pay the bills. So check out his channel, uh, Thack Ironworks, that's T-H-A-K Ironworks. I apologize for this vice work, I should have had the camera on the other side, but I think you get the idea. At this point, he looks like he's wearing a fez or some other similar hat.
At this point, I can refine the features. Deepen and push the eyes outward. Deepen and push the nasal cavity upward and add some teeth. It's amazing how just small changes really alter the look. He's still got a bit of that turban or hat on his head, and rather than do more hammering, I'm going to try grinding this and to round off his skull some and see what that looks like. Definitely looks more human at this point. As far as realistic skulls go, I'm definitely not competing with Thak, that's for sure. But I think my idea of using a bolt might appeal to some people, especially if you keep the threads intact. I had so much fun with this one that I made another, maybe better one, right away. Catch you guys next time.